Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Cooking Live. I'm Chef Patrice Olivon, and I'm gonna make you a better cook. Today on the menu, what do we have on the menu? We have today a butternut squash soup, and also we're gonna be making uh, uh, either a red snapper, a grouper, um, a rockfish, few different uh, fish that you could pick from. Mix it up, move it up like that. So what you wanna do is the take the dirt off the leaves the, of the pieces of leeks like this, okay? So just don't be afraid, just, you know, put your hands in there and then, very good, let's put that in here also, just a touch. That's it, ah, there you go. We can always adjust, remember. What's important is with your knife in here, you gotta cut the, the top of the peppers, but what you wanna do is try to be right under the, the core, which is, you know, when the stems stop right there. Bring those uh, red peppers, uh, into the pot like that and if you look at it you almost have as much red pepper than you have onions mine looks pretty good in here if yours looks like this you're in very good shape okay we're gonna put the lid back in here uh, those are the, the we call it the uh, um, medium size they have of, co of course jumbo asparagus interesting all right very good especially with the color of the asparagus and the red peppers be nice beautiful oyster mushrooms um, they call them oyster mushroom because th when they grow like that they almost look like an oyster yeah half of this and a good amount of chai and this is good flavor here for the mushrooms could give us some color also which is nice there you go Uh, it needs a little salt, but um, the olive oil is good. The lemon, I'm happy with the lemon juice also. Uh, maybe I'm gonna add a little bit of uh, black peppercorn. There you go. Again, I'm gonna do the same thing in here. Look at the technique. Flat on the cutting board. Put tension on the skin as you move forward with your knife, the angle of the knife toward the cutting board, of course. This way, you don't waste any uh, meat between the skin and the fish. It's not a breaded fish. The reason why I do that is to create a little bit of a crunch on top. And then from now, let's go to the oven, everyone. Because if you leave it on the stove, you gotta bring it down to the heat a lot. Otherwise, the bread's going to burn. That looks pretty good. But the safest way to do that is to take it and put it in the oven. So let's go ahead and put that in the oven. You go over the plate, you pour, and if you touch it again, whatever the dropper was ready to go down, you actually make it coming down. So this way you can space it out, okay? So we're gonna put about two uh, layers of soup. All right, there you go. The same kind of a presentation. Push it a bit, there we go. I guess I have extra asparagus in here, that's okay. We're all gonna jump on it, right? All right. It's falling on the side a little bit, but that's okay. All right. Smells nice, huh? So make sure you serve this dish hot because you know it's very nice when it's hot and the soup also, okay? I wish you everyone a wonderful week and I'll see you next week.